right, welcome everyone to today's HLA product showcase, Read Our Lips, from the Canadian Heart of Hearing Association, Newfoundland and Labrador. Thank you for joining us today. My name is Amanda Watson and I am the meeting planner for HLAA and your host today. Today's presentation is being recorded and will be available for playback at a later time on the HLA website, hearingloss.org. All right. Um, this is a disclaimer that HLAA does not endorse the product featured in this webinar. HLAA is providing an educational opportunity to learn about this product and how it could benefit people with hearing loss. Now I will give you some uh, technical tips. To see the captions on this webinar, you will need to click the, on the CC icon and click on show subtitle. You can change the font size and subtitle settings. Chat is available for technical issues only and panelists only. We would like participants to please use the Q&A icon to ask questions. We will use this to facilitate questions and answers after the presentation. If you've joined by computer, the presentation should be in side-by-side -side mode. Slides are on the left and the panelists are on the right in gallery view. You can change the size of your side-by-side -side view by hovering between the two screens and moving the gray bar to adjust to your desired size. If you've joined by mobile device or phone, your view may be different and you may have to scroll between views to the desired one. All right, well, our presenter today is Allison Butler, who has uh, spent the last 15 years as a speech lip reading instructor with the Canadian Heart of Hearing Association of Newfoundland and Labrador. Um, all right, well, I've stopped my screen share and uh, looks like Allison's all set. So I will pass it over to you, go ahead. Thank you so much. Hi everyone and welcome to the presentation. So as introduced, I am Allison and I was the project manager involved in creating this exciting online learning platform called Read Our Lips. And I was a lip reading and speech reading instructor for many years in the classroom. And we wanted to take that learning experience online so that anyone in the world could learn the skills needed to get started with lip reading as a skill. Today, we are going to speak about the five benefits of learning to lip read and I'm also going to introduce you to the Read Our Lips learning program. Just think about all the places in our lives where it can be difficult to hear and understand, where there's background noise. We live in a noisy world and COVID aside, we are going to start going back to a more regular routine very soon. These are just a few examples of places that can be challenging to hear, at restaurants, in team meetings, at family gatherings. When there are listening challenges, there are many different types of tools that can help us with communication. Some use listening technology like hearing aids or cochlear implants. Some use other types of personal listening devices. Some use skills like lip reading or speech reading. To get the most benefit, we use as many skills as possible, as many things as we have available to us to help make communication easier. Today, we are focusing on the benefits of learning the skill of lip reading, also commonly called speech reading. So what exactly is this? Well, lip reading is learning to watch for visual cues on the mouth, specific movements of the lip, tongue, and jaw that are associated with different speech sounds. Lip reading helps you identify words or to fill in the blanks that your hearing technology or your available hearing may have missed. It's a skill that can help you build confidence as you communicate. It can help in those challenging listening environments. Is it perfect? No. 
it's a tool in your toolbox. And it doesn't matter if you've had hearing loss for years or if you're just starting to explore a small drop in your hearing. We can all benefit from adding to our skills and our confidence, especially in background noise. Today, we are going to focus on five benefits of how lip reading can support you in your day to day, including number one, let's talk about those video calls, just like we are on today. Video communication is great for anyone with hearing challenges because we can see the speaker's face, but sometimes there can still be hiccups, like the sound may not always be great. Um, today we have a live captioner, but often when we are using our programs on our own, we may have automated caption features and they can sometimes lag behind the speaker, which means what? We have to rely on those extra skills in our toolbox for improved communication and understanding. Number two, that challenging background noise. We all struggle with this. When there's background noise in any setting, it's harder to hear. So our ears plus our technology aren't always catching everything. And it can also be harder to concentrate or focus in background noise. In my experience as an instructor, this is one of the big motivating factors behind wanting to improve lip reading skills. Plus, we all want to feel like secret spies being able to lip read conversations from across the room. But that's more advanced than at the introduction stage. In challenging listening environments, lip reading can really help us to fill in the blanks of things that our ears might be missing. Number three, one of the biggest complaints I hear from people is, and I'm sure you will relate to me here, it's not me, it's them. They are horrible communicators. They don't open their mouth when they speak, they mumble, etc. Is that true? Probably. I'm not even going to disagree with you. A lot of people out there are really terrible communicators. But what if you think about it like this? You tell family, friends, coworkers that you are learning this great new skill, lip reading. You ask them if they will practice with you in person or on a video call. In order to practice, they need to face you. They need to speak clearly. It helps them understand what you need. It helps them become better communicators overall. So not only are we learning a new skill that can help us, but we are also improving communication skills for those around us. We are helping them understand, and you'll probably have a few laughs along the way. So learning a new skill has the potential to bring you closer to the people in your life. Number four, feeling like you are part of the conversation can help you feel more connected to the people that matter to you. Do other people have to play a role in how they communicate as well? Yes, they sure do. But you can also do everything you can to help yourself. Having different skills can help you feel left out less often and more connected to what is happening around you. And finally, number five, how can lip reading skills enhance or add to your existing technology, like hearing aids or implantable devices? One way that we've already spoken about is they help fill in the blanks if things were missed. Even though there have been all kinds of incredible advances with technology and background noise features, there are always situations where technology isn't perfect and you might need to fall back on some of your additional skills. For example, what happens when your batteries die in the middle of an important conversation? I can think of many examples over the years where the skill of lip reading has really helped someone when their technology stopped working for whatever reason. 
So those are some of the benefits of learning how to lip read or to practicing your lip reading skills. Now let's take a look inside the Read Our Lips online learning program so you can have a better idea of what this looks like and how Read Our Lips can help you enhance your skills. This is the home screen of Read Our Lips. It shares more about the benefits of learning to lip read, all which we have discussed today. When purchasing, you receive eight lessons covering eight of the easier lip movements, and you get six months of unlimited access to practice your skills at your own pace. You can create an account in a couple of easy steps. I'm actually just going to play this so you can see as it works its way through the website. The learning program is a one-time cost. Now our prices are in Canadian dollars. The course costs $49 Canadian, which is approximately $40 US or about $5 a lesson. So it's a great value. And this is not a subscription. You get the six months of access for that price. Stay tuned until the end of the presentation because we have a really special offer for all of you that are here live today. And it's really simple to set up your account. You just put in your name and your email address and you are set up and ready to go. So this is what the inside of the course, um, the learning program looks like. Each lesson in the learning program teaches you to practice one specific lip movement. I'm going to show you an example of what these lessons look like. Please note that there is no sound in my presentation, so you will not hear the audio part here today. There are introduction and teaching videos for each lesson with captions. Watch along here to get an idea of what this looks like in the Read Our Lips learning program. This is one of the introduction lessons with lip movement. And that is me in the introduction videos as well. Um, so you can see that they are video and captions and start teaching more about what those lip movements look like. So those are the introductions. Once you are inside the course, this is what each lesson is laid out like. You can see each step on the left hand side and all of the content, explanations and videos are in the center we walk you through everything step by step. It's very easy to use, even if you aren't all that technology savvy. You need a computer, a tablet or phone, and a high-speed internet connection. Each lesson contains videos where we see the front angle and a side angle of a speaker's face. There is no sound with any of these videos and you get to play them as many times as you need to watching the speaker's face. Let's just take a look at what this looks like. So this is an example of a lesson. There's lots of, lots of introduction for you. And we will see now what one of the practice videos looks like. And I want to caution you don't be scared if you have no idea what he's saying. That's normal and very much part of the learning process. You get lots of clues to help you along the way. So we watch the speaker's face in all of the lessons. You can also, we'll watch the side. It's a lot of fun. You can also speed up or slow down the speaker's lip movements. Some may find this helpful and others may not. 
it really allows us to focus in on the movements of the lip, which is really the name of the game here in lip reading. So you can adjust the speed. Once we've watched the videos a couple of times and made some educated guesses about what the answers could be, we can actually scroll down for some multiple choice clues. This can help us to verify if we are on the right track or if our eyes are deceiving us. Take one more look at his face. Then we get to check our answers. If it's correct, we can move on. If not, we try again. I might have cheated here because I know what all the answers are. <laughs> So that just gives you a little preview of what it looks like inside the course, very easy to use. Each lesson also includes optional resources on a variety of topics related to hearing and communication. There is a lot of really useful information here and feedback from our users has shown that a lot of participants find this really helpful. Think of it like a bonus section in each of the eight lessons. There are also PDF handouts with all of this information that can be saved to your computer or printed if that suits you. So in this part, I'm going to just click on one of the resources, uh, communication tips. It will open up in a new window and you get these great PDFs that you can save to your own computer uh, if you would like. We have had a lot of great feedback from Read Our Lips participants. And I just have a few of these captured here today. Um, each page guides you through the learning program step by step, and you can move through all of the information at whatever speed works for you. And people tell us it has been very easy to use. And our customer support team is always here to help anyone that has challenges. So let's talk about how you can get started on your own lip reading journey to learn a new skill or to practice skills that you've been working on over time. How do we get started? You can visit this link and we'll pop it into the question and answer box at the end as well. But the website is read our lips edu.edu.com and we have a couple of bonuses for you so this week if you purchase read our lips you can use the code HLAA to get 20% off your purchase and I'm going to show you exactly how you do that so make note of that the code is HLAA after you create your account um, before you make your payment, you will see a screen that looks like this, and it says enter coupon or gift card code. So that is the spot where you would click and type in HLAA to get access to um, your specific discount. And I have another special bonus for those of you who are attending the presentation today. I'm really hoping that you are as excited about this learning opportunity as we are. So this week, when you sign up for the Read Our Lips online learning program by Sunday, June 6th, that's the deadline, you will get to be part of a complimentary live one hour lip reading class with me. And what will we do together in that uh, class? I will help get you comfortable with the online Read Our Lips learning program. I will answer questions for you and we will do some lip reading practice together. It's always a lot of fun. And this class will be recorded and shared with you if you are unable to attend the live class. So that's it from me and my official presentation. We have a few minutes remaining and I'm more than happy to answer your questions. You can type your question into the Q&A box here in the Zoom webinar, 
or if you would rather reach out to our customer support team, I have the email address there, as well as the website where you can go to learn more. So I'm actually just going to open up the Q&A box so I can see a couple of questions. All right. So, yes, I agree that video calls are amazing unless the video becomes choppy. Yes, and you're right. And that might be one situation where lip reading um, may not work as well. Um, there's so many different products you can try. I often personally find that one of the big challenges around video calls is that you really have to have a great internet connection. So sometimes it really comes down to the internet connection and not necessarily the video call program that you're using. Okay, we have another question. Um, so, so you actually, I'll just go back to the first one. So you mentioned FaceTime. Um, there's also Google Meet or Skype um, or here like on a Zoom platform, all of which have um, free options for video calling. Um, yes, our question about masks. Yes, masks make it extremely difficult to read lips. And that's something that we've been hearing from a lot of people. We're hoping that we won't always have to wear masks. And there are certain situations like on calls like this where we don't have a mask on. Um, we always recommend that people wear masks with a clear panel and that can help you to be able to um, see and hear. But I don't have any perfect solution for you with a mask. Um, it's certainly a really big challenge and for sure a lot of people are realizing how much they rely on lip reading now that people are wearing masks. Um, but part of this learning process, the way I see it, is that we are building our skills and planning and preparing for the future when we hopefully don't have to wear masks. And that's a really important part of this. We're learning and building our skills to be lip readers. So Martha asked the questions of after the six months. So right now, this, pro, this learning program is just six months, um, six months of access. At that point, your course ends. We are in the process of creating some additional practice courses. They are not ready quite yet, but hopefully in the very near future, once you complete your six month practice, you will have opportunities to go on to additional Read Our Lips practice courses. Um, Shirley asked how, oh, so many questions. And if I don't get to all of your questions today, please use that, write down that email address and connect with our customer support team. I'm afraid um, that I'm not going to get to all of the questions. Um, okay, Shirley asked about please reviewing the sign up details. Um, if you reach out to our customer support, Shirley, they will walk you through all of those steps. But if you visit the website, that is the first step. So visiting the website and clicking on the buy course is where you start. Uh, and then you can put in that HLAA discount code. Um, John, the low light piece is sort of a, what I would call a coping strategy. So those are the sorts of things that we speak about a little bit more in the additional resources of the course. So in low light, yes, it can be difficult to lip read. And then it sort of becomes, how do we troubleshoot this low light situation? How do we advocate for ourselves to be able to see and hear better in low light situations. So while it's not maybe a specific part of the course, 
the, the learning program very much focuses on how to recognize those movements of the mouth. And that's the key part in learning and building that skill. But a lot of those extra things are covered in those bonus um, additional resource sections. There's actually a lot of great material there. Uh, and people have given us really great feedback on that. Um, how long is this course? So it's completely self-paced. So once you have access, you can move through each lesson as slowly or quickly as you need to. So that's really important. Um, so you have access for six months and you can work through it at your own pace. And so I would encourage um, reviewing a lesson, doing the practice, and then practicing those particular skills with um, out there in your real life, whatever that looks like for you right now, whether it's interacting with others or um, here in some kind of capacity on a video call. Um, Linda, your question about the no sound, when we are practicing the lip movement, um, those videos have no sound. It allows us to really focus in and concentrate on the movements of the mouth. Is it more challenging than real life? Yes. Um, when we teach, or when I was teaching in a classroom environment, um, we make those lip movements without sound in the classroom. So it focus, it allows us to really focus in on how is the mouth moving? How are the lips, jaw, face, how is everything moving that helps us to learn that skill? Okay, lots of questions here. I'm just going to, some might take a long time to answer. And so please, oh, Kat said the, the discount code. The discount code is HLAA. So write that down. Um, John, I'm, <laughs> um, I'm going to uh, say that the accent piece is challenging for sure. And again, you have to think of this as a basic introduction class. So um, the question is, uh, does the course help us with lip reading people with heavy accents? And thank you to the person who reminded me that only I could see the questions. I actually didn't realize that. Um, and I'm running out of time. Um, so I'm going to encourage you to email your questions, to write down this email address and email your questions to our, um, to our customer support, okay? Um, the heavy accents piece, keep in mind that this is a basic introductory skill. So, it's not teaching us at this point. We are building upon our skills. We are learning how to identify those key speech movements and watch for them. Um, obviously those with heavy accents may move their mouth in different ways. So that's important to keep in mind, but this is a skill that we can build upon, okay? So I think I have to, um, stop. <laughs> I'm going to probably get kicked off. Um, I'll, I'm going to ask some of my, let me just see if I can put, um, okay. Uh, Marin is helping us answer the questions. So I am going to, uh, type a couple of responses here with the website address for ordering. Okay. All right. Well, thank you so much, Allison, for um, demonstrating Read Our Lips today. Thank you, Lisa Johnston, for her amazing cart services today. 
Um, the webinar will be posted on the HLIA website at hearinglots.org. It was reported. So please check back to hearinglots.org for our future webinars and webinar recordings. And uh, thank you all for joining us today. Um, stay safe and be well.